Luke O'Connor was only 19, a business study student in his second year at Manchester Metropolitan University. But at 2am on Wednesday morning, Luke was fatally stabbed, heading home from a night out. In a statement, Luke's family said, Our lively, bubbly, beautiful boy has been taken from us and our family are now left with a hole in our hearts that will never be filled. The attack happened in an area of Manchester full of student pubs, clubs and takeaways that were open at the time. It was just metres from university accommodation. This photograph, shared exclusively with Sky News, was taken in the immediate aftermath. It shows groups of young people crowded around the police cordon as emergency teams search the scene. I'd been inside the pub um, with my mates and we walked out and there was police everywhere and um, there was people in like bad states and stuff like that. And no one really knew what had happened at the time. We could see a knife on the floor. It's not nice happening on your doorstep. Yeah, it's, it's a really sad time for the people of the area. Um, I couldn't imagine what the families and friends of the, of the, of the poor boy that um, it happened to are feeling. Greater Manchester Police have now introduced a Section 60 for this immediate area. That means that it gives them additional powers to stop and search anyone for that temporary time. They say they know that can make people worried, but they say they're doing it to keep people safe because students here are frightened. I'd say a lot of students are feeling very unsettled, like particularly even just living around the corner. We're like taking more precautions to lock our doors, lock our windows. No one's getting buses anymore. Police call this a terrible crime. Luke's family say they want justice to be served for their beautiful young son, robbed of life. Katerina Vitozzi, Sky News in Manchester.